Hello there, everyone, and welcome back to Old World Blues. I'm your host, Mr. Mocha Lover, and right now we uh, need to read about the East Coast Exiles. To our astonishment, a group of unrecognized vertebrates have approached a location with a legitimate enclave call sign. They are led by a lieutenant named Schultz, supporting enclave power armor. Schultz traveled from the Raven Rock facility in the capital wasteland, leading a Verda assault team dispatched by Colonel Autumn to salvage assets from the ashes of Navarro on the rig. The mission, mission was an uh, errand designed by Autumn to purge opposition from his ranks. Those that survived found us, of course, not ruins. While news of this illegitimate president Eden is troubling, most of the Enclave's vertebrates went east with Autumn's father, and Schultz's tactical experience could have proven valuable in integrating air power within the Enclave, or with Enclave ground forces. A surprise, but a welcome one. Nice, and as you can see here, we're at war, of course, with the uh, Sky Reavers, and we actually encircled these guys, and we're feeling pretty good about it. So let's just go in and teach them some valuable lessons the old power armor way. Oh, completely surrounded, just, just getting... Just gassed really hard with... Oh, that's so nice. I just... Oh, well, you, me, and power armor, what could be better than that, man? What could be better? We've got some comments to go through. And some things to talk about. Americans win and all. I think I read this one yesterday, so if you'd like to read this one, please go right ahead. In which we do get uh, complete integration, which is fine, but the vertebrate crashes into Legion territory. Mr. President, it appears that one of your vertebrates has seemed to crash or was engaging in peaceful reconnaissance over Legion territory. Sadly, our efforts to maintain the technology that was designed, that was designed before a global atomic war two centuries ago, although impressive, is not perfect, as the vertebrate did crash. Kaisal's men are ransacking the crash site, and although they probably cannot build vertebrates, they may give them insights into rebuilding their own air force. Well, at least the Brotherhood didn't get the plans. Eh, good for them, good for them. Oh, I just want to commit... Crimes. Crimes. Um, you guys go right there, and then you guys... Ooh, here, let me do. There you go. It's fine. It'll be fine. Mm, really not to worry about this side, or either side, really. I'm going to worry about that, but it's Excellent job for the engineers. Let us put this relic back online at last. Well, would you look at that. Oh, that is so nice. And we currently get no political power. Because we've begun integration. That's right. I forgot about that. That's right. This sucks. Ah, but Ranger City does very nice. Very, very nice. Alright, slowly chomping away at destroying all of their industry, which is super nice. We have 72% legitimacy, which is actually pretty darn good, I'll be honest. At this point, uh, do we have any planes? Please, let me just gun people down. We need more fighters, too, though. Nice, good. Very, very good. Americans winning all. And we'll talk about this in a little bit because we because there are some comments that uh, uh, that we do need to go through. Um, accept them mm, versus reject them. We'll see in just a little bit. But I do officials went off. We didn't really have the score like I said yesterday. So the Yakuza imitated advantage Japan. We know they're really Americans. They just need, just need to be reminded. But really per per persevere or preserve Japanese culture. The Yakuza are fierce fighters and would swear loyalty to us in exchange for autonomy. Wouldn't we rather they point their guns at our enemies? Eh, maybe. But right now, I do want to go to war with the 80s. I'll be honest, I, I want to go to war with them. So we're just going to uh, retake our core territories. It's, uh, two months to take them out. That's pretty nice. That's pretty darn nice, not going to lie. And we'll go to war with the fiends eventually. Okay, then. Um, go, Just go ahead. I, I don't want to wait any longer. I really don't. As you can see, we're increasing our border with the NCR. We'll talk about the NCR later on, uh, once we get a much bigger military. I'm, I want, I'm shooting for a massive military right now. Extract spies, now we're okay. Also, someone did say that you can do spies, um, our actual intelligence agency, <coughs> to boost ideology here, which I didn't realize. Like, I barely really use the intelligence agency stuff, so. But yeah, that actually sounds like a really good idea. Um, they yeah, have a lot of guys here, so one, two, three. Three, one, two, three, versus a massive four. Uh, realistically, hmm, we got enough power armor, but we never really have enough. Plans are looking good. This is looking really good as well. Do we have enough fighters? Yeah, we do. Support equipment. Get a lot of that going first. Uh, I do want to throw you guys right here, but you might not be good enough, realistically. Hmm. Let him go over there. I don't think we have enough guys for this just yet. That's okay. Actually, for you guys, I do want to increase your combat width. I don't know. Ooh, hopefully... Ooh, we cannot do that yet. That is not ideal. Hmm. Let's do that first. Uh, cost of manpower and training queue? Eh, whatever. Former department is going to be very nice. And what can we do here? Daniel King. I only like to do two at a time, just because, or get 
I only do operations two at a time just because I don't want to hurt these things too much. Boom, boom, just in case. You never know. Maybe, maybe. And make sure these guys have orders as well. <coughs> okay, anyway, sorry. I just sneeze there. Civilization by force, which would be nice. These Americans have fallen on hard times. It's the burden of the Enclave to bring enlightenment to this begotten land, whether they want it or not, versus established tributaries. Which is the one we'll do, because we'll get quarters on them anyways. We can protect tribal culture by giving them autonomy in exchange for men. Because we love men here. Old America did this and no one complained. Absolutely. So that's okay. They'll probably do okay there. These guys down here will probably do okay as well. I'm just worried about this line, because we have one division per tile, which is not great. But then again, they don't have that many divisions either. And we just finished combined arms. Let's go and do this as well and just do normal research. Thank you very much. We're doing some roads, which is okay. Uh, radar's okay as well. You know what? I want to build some civvies. I want to build a lot of civvies for now. Lots and lots of civvies. It's not going to give us any more GDP or anything like that, but whatever. Support the old world party? Eh, I could try that again. Why not? We get enough PP for that right now, right? Oh, investigate rumors? Sure, why not? Oh, and there goes... Okay, the... goodbye then. Okay, you guys are going to die. Uh, if we wanted to go to war, we'd probably go to war with them now. But, ooh, grenades, grenade launchers, heavy incinerators. I don't know, I feel like the, the, the Enclave would use grenades, so... There we go. Land auction's coming along, finishing it off, and we'll keep down, going down this way, too. Nice. Keep training for now. We've got to make more infantry. Got to make more power armor divisions. Stonks, bull, maybe bear. Very nice, very nice, very nice. There you go. Awesome, awesome. I don't know, maybe we'll just go to war anyways with these guys. Especially if we have air superiority, that'd be very good. All these guys reply soon enough. And let's see. Transports are nice for five. Good. Gonna get paid soon. Assimilation, uh, that's fine. Not really interested in that stuff right now. Uh, gunship's not enough that I really want to change things up because we might lose them while doing that. McGill, huh? Oh, we have another hole here. Okay, that's not really good then. Uh, we definitely need another group here. Pop them out. There we go. So that tributaries are nice. Field surgery doctrine is very good. So this stuff is all done over here. We'll talk about c civil rights and stuff later on. Let's just go ahead and do the con job. The great cons block our access to New Vegas, but of course not for very long. All right, make sure you're all Enclave Auxiliaries. I'm going to throw you right here. 12 more divisions are nice. And there you go. Actually, are you Power Armor, dude? Yeah, you are. Oh, you're the Power Armor, dude. Okay. Let's go up there, then. That's fine. Inspirational, and... That should be good enough. We'll see. We're not going to have enough equipment just yet. We got dynamite done, of course. Let's grab some of this, too. That'd be nice. All right. Because now we have tribal militias. Nope. Nope. You guys are looking okay. Get some. Get a lot of demos. Uh, we just need a lot of soft attack. Um, I don't want to spend this much army XP, but we're going to need to, realistically. And I know we have no dynamite right now. Well, actually, we do have some dynamite. Look at that. I guess I was misspoken. Mmm... It was by five. Convert all the occupied territories to do this one. Riders. There you go. Skyvers. Wait. Are you guys not cord? What, what? Wait. Why are you not? Is that? That's got to be a bug in the game. Or maybe not. Is that part of? No, it's part of the North Mojave. I guess. Hmm. Weird. New Vegas. Las Vegas is part of Nevada. I don't know why that's not cord. Maybe that's normally part of Utah. No, not Utah. No, maybe it is Utah. Arizona? No, not Arizona. Hmm. Odd. Okay. Well, whatever. <clears throat> let's let's fish up, fish up, fix some of the stuff here. Five percent, seven percent is better. Over here, we're gonna grab. I love the Artie, and that'll help out with our infantry. So, you know what, Orion though, I would like to get him too. Defense is nice. Pair drop attack and de defense. I like that. But if we're gonna fifteen oh, percent, I've got to go fifteen. Production policies, we got to go with greasers, of course. And we're out of PP already. Wow, that's fast. Tearing down the house. Probably do that when Mr. House thinks he's in control of New Vegas, but we've had a wild card to play. Or we have a wild card to play. Are we out any more? No. Poop him out. There you go. You three go right here. Right there. At this point, I'm pulling you out. You going in there. We're really out of power armor now, but whatever. And you get a promotion. Welcome aboard. And you come right here and do that. Because we can go to war by whenever we want. That's right. Pain train it is. 
And the inspiration would be nice. After this, Klamath. It's, that's all part of California and Oregon, so... Backyard workshops will be very beneficial right now. Let's go and do that, because I don't really care. And we'll go to World of the Great Cons after this, probably. Take it down the house. Why not? Might as well. Give us a few more days. How bad do these guys really look? Oh, they're not looking honestly that bad. We have minus 1500 power armor. Not great, but whatever. Actually, if that's the case. I'm going to convert the rest of these power armor divisions to 20 combo width eventually, which would be nice, but it's going to take some time. And you guys looking okay? You guys looking okay? Uh, actually. There you go. Make sure you got at least some fighters here. Get some uh, cast. Okay, we don't have to be the aggressors here. Now, I think that's worth it. Hey, what happened to those planes? Attack. Alright, there you go. Reliability, no, we just go with that damage. Nice, 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 nice. Very good. Um, Send out spies, we could. Sure, why not. Naval, restore Naval Air Station Fallon. Very good. Very, very good. And we got eight days left. Let's stop training. You guys will be fine. Once they start attacking us like crazy, as long as we get good enough, to, you know, trenchmen and defense, we should be okay. Even though uh, I, I personally would not recommend using a lot of infantry for the army. It's generally pretty weak. But I got 3,000 manpower. We're gonna really raise the conscription level up very high later on. Hey, okay. Well, we wasted people trying to justify on them, but okay. And they're suffering a lot. Not bad. Pretty good. I think that's pretty good. What do you guys think? I think that's pretty tasty. And we're pretty comparable in terms of divisions, too. So I'm just really trying to get a bigger army here. That's all I want. You know what? They want to attack us. That's fine with me. So we can go to War of the Fiends, obviously. We can go to War of the Great Cons. We'll go to War of New Vegas. And we'll be turning down the house, but securing the Big MT. The Big MT was one of the greatest sites of pre-war research. And rumors of flickering lights haunting the night suggest that there still could be much to be gained from an expedition to its ruins. What's the worst that could happen? We could end up dead. But probably not in this campaign. Oh, look at this. This is really bad, too. Uh, partial mobiles. Oh, War Economy. Oh, yes, please. Oh, that's nice. That's much better, actually. Probably get some fuel eventually as well. Very nice. Um, we're looking really good on everything here. So, some comments. Someone says, the Nevada Path... Actually, one of my Disc Discord mods says, the Nevada Path is much easier if we give rights to ghouls and mutants. If we go with full... Fully accepting other people or other creatures or other wastelanders or whatever. It's, someone says it's much easier. Uh, but someone else says that I went full integration last time as well, so don't accept them. Reject them. Which, you know what, I almost never reject them, so I'm thinking we might just reject them, just to make it a little different. And also, if we reject them, we don't lose legitimacy, but if legitimacy is a concern, we have 77% right now. In addition, I didn't realize this, but we get 15% here, we get another 15% here, and we get another 15% with the Constitution of Nevada. We can create discriminatory states with 100% legitimacy. That sounds like a lot of a fun. That sounds like the America I want to be in. Hmm. Anyways. Never mind. Um. Huh. Never mind. Actually, do we have any upgrades for these guys? Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. Expedition of the Big Empty. Uh, before that, reconnaissance. Yeah. That's, that's really good to do. Before the war, one of the greatest centers of Andy was the Big Empty, long thought to be destroyed. Whispers of eerie lights in the night at the center of this site inspired an expedition. To a surprise, we found a realm of wonders and terrors, cybernetic enhancements, holographic technology, and new ceramics, but also shambling corpses, robotic scorpions, and malevolent fauna. As a vertebrate's descent, passing over the corpse of some poor courier, the president must 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 what to do with the facility, or must decide what to do. Be careful, we don't know what forbidden technology we'll find. To our surprise, pre-war scientists have survived in the think tank, adopting robotic bodies. Time's not been kind, and they're clearly insane in the mainframe. We'll almost dream of leaving to experiment in the waste. What the one called Mobius has warned us that is that this will end only in tears. A few have suggested that it might be worth supporting the research. There's no stopping progress, not bad. Shut them down. Persuade them to stay in the big MT. I think that's the one we want to do, probably. Research speed's okay. Nice. Restoring the Big MT. We like them big. Now that we've dealt with the original inhabitants, we can turn the Big MT towards Enclave's research. Please note that calling it the Big Full will result in a firing squad. Big Full, huh? Awesome, and now we're done with our line doctrine. Great! Also, like, I, I, I know. I know someone's going to comment eventually that I need to play as the big the think tank. And I know. I keep forgetting. Honestly, I don't know that much about him. I, I'm going to research him a little bit before I actually play him. I might just start off the campaign with him. Uh, Available and alive. I've heard they're difficult and it's not a great focus shooter now, but I do need to try them out. Try them out sometimes, so. I know, I remember. Every time I play Old World Blues, I always get remembered. I always get remembered? I always get told to remember. We killed off 11,000 of these guys so far. Like, guys. 
A simple push. And they will literally be dying here. Alright, power armor, just go ahead. Exterminate with extreme prejudice. And when I say extreme prejudice, I mean extreme prejudice. Like, I don't want a single one of our enemies living here next. Like, I want them, there just to be so much blood on the ground that it's not even funny. <laughs> I've had a long day. <laughs> More political power, less stability. That's not bad. Veronica Santan Santangelo. She looks, look how happy she is. I kind of want to get her just because she's happy. I'm going to, you know, I'm going to go with, uh, with uh, Arcade Ganon, because her's a consumer goods. We get 20% more political power. So 1.44, 1.88. So it hurts the consumer goods, but eventually, well, quite enough consumer goods, it doesn't really matter. Um, in addition, I also don't want to forget that we do need to liberate Utah and the rest of Nevada and such like that. So don't want to forget about that either. But honestly, we're looking good. Look at the power armor. 450 already. I want. I said exterminate. I said exterminate. I want their bodies hanging on a cross. Well, I guess we're not the Legion. I should buy the Legion against them down. Oh, that sucks. Well, crap. That sucks. Well, I guess I haven't investigated again. Well, once again, another PP. I just want to exterminate. Oh, nice. We got implant access technology. We got all this stuff. Awesome, 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 awesome. Fixing broken hills. Although the wasteland thought the broken hills mine ran dry, that's because the mining companies use 19th century technology. Harvesting uranium and gold with primitive engineering equipment. Enclave engineering can do better. Yeah. And it will investigate the rumors too soon. 1.8 is really, really nice though. We do got to keep an eye on our manpower though. Because we only have so much. Are we still mobilizing? We should be though, right? No, we're not. Okay. We're at 7%. Volunteer army already. Oh, go the... Okay, who's raiding us? Oh, okay, at this point, I'm done. I'm done with these guys. I'm, I'm going to I'm going to kill them. I was actually thinking about just letting them, let bygones be bygones. Be like, okay, we're going to get Haze all the way up there. No, I, this is... this is. I want to say a lot of bad words right now. And they took the territory, because they can. This, there's a lot of bad words just running through my mind right now that we're not going to say on the channel, just because I don't want to be like that type of channel. But, like, oh my gosh. Genocide is not even going to be available for the NCR. Like, I am going to... Mmm. Mmm. They are going to regret doing this. They are going to heavily regret doing that. As soon as the Legion goes to war with them, I am going to just... Just... Mmm. Mmm. I hate the NCR. A false democracy. Did I not give you orders? I must not have given you orders. My bad. There you go, guys. It doesn't even matter. That's why I'm trying to rush out a lot of divisions. And trying to get as much territory as possible. Actually, at this point, um, let's go to Murtaugh Reformers maybe next. Just because I want to take more, take, take more regions, take more land, take more land. I mean, obviously we want to create other states, but we'll create those states eventually. I want to get all the manpower we can first, so. And this is not enough divisions to hold the entire line just yet. Even though we can go to war these guys too. Um, I'll send you guys down. Send you guys down first. You guys go there. And you guys go right there. We'll try that one out. Yeah, I I'm going to kill off the NCR. I'm sorry, but I we, we have to. We have to. They're just pieces of garbage that need to die. That literally just... They need to die. Reclaiming Air 51. Oh, yeah. That'd be really good. We can wait for that real quick. I want to reform the general staff or... National Guard. Yeah, National Guard. The diva citizen militia is cute, but pre-war America's formalized military forces made up of civilians subject to military training. Or had formalized it. Why would we do anything different? Because we like being different. Beautiful. The National Guard. Oh, more. Oh, yeah, these guys are fine. There you go. Where are the dogs? Oh, boy, where are the doggerinos? All right, spend a uh, Stephen Reynolds. Nice. Um, I mean, realistically, we could kill these guys off. We could probably hold the line here, actually, and do okay. I did say I want to pair, pair drop a lot more. I remember saying that in the first episode, and I haven't really held on to that promise. I might just want to drain them of their resources. Just drain them of the manpower to get a bunch of you know, army XP and stuff. I might actually do that instead. You just go in. You just... Just... The NCR pisses me off, so I'm going to take my anger and frustration out on the great cons. There will be no massacre because we will not let the free press uh, give them information about it. Second massacre? I said we wouldn't let the free press know about that. What did I just say? Uh, doing Taking these guys out right now is actually probably a really bad idea just because um, the, the Legion will probably most definitely attack later on. Just going to be real. 
Uh, they will attack later on. So let's go five. Let's go with more guns just in case. Get some more of that too. Go with that and dynamite grenades. Yes. Good to go. Yes, we are. They immediately attack us. You know what? Let them just kind of waste their time. Look at that. I like that. It just it just racing up. So nice. So nice. Mexican engineering. We love Mexican engineering here. Robot parade. Robot parade. Wave the flags that the enclave, of course, did made. Robot parade. Robot parade. Robots obey what the enclave does say. Um, also, so I did ask you guys yesterday what we should call our intelligence agency, and you guys came up with some good names, but I think I'm going to go with a particular name once I finish all this research stuff, which will, will, which will include the event. Oh, caps lock. I can spell this time. And with the Nevada Intelligence Agency, we're going to say stop. I, I think we'll go this one. That seems a little bit more fitting. I like stop, but this one's more fitting. Um, cool. Boost everything else up there. Get a lot of civvies where we need to be. And defense are online. Great, great, great. National Guard. And Mexican Engine and Manering. I don't think you can get any more legitimacy by just doing this stuff. By building infrastructure in these areas, but I could be wrong. Um, uh, civilian power grids. I think, technically, we could use that, but eh. We're kind of okay. Let's build more stuff up if we need to. That's fine. And how are we doing against New Vegas? Are they doing well? We have 36 army XP. Oh my goodness, how many are dead? 800 almost. They, have, they literally just lost at least one more division. Okay, they, they keep attacking. Okay, they lost another one too. This is nice. This is really nice, actually. Alright, so they're down to 49. Um, look at all the, look how weak those robots are. 48? Hey, they must be doing forced attack or something. I love it. I love it. Please, beat yourself into me. Beat me. Beat me harder? Hmm. Anyways, uh, I say a lot of weird stuff, as you can probably tell by now. And if you don't can't tell that by now, I mean I say some really weird stuff on the channel. Beat me harder, Daddy. Anyways, um, restore Doug Way proving grounds. Yes, please. Promote support for Nevada. Uh, that one too. We're going to keep doing that anyways because we can because we're going to launch a civil war. Uh, investigate rumors. Very good. Are they done attacking? What, baby? Mr. House. Okay then. Okay. Yeah, I was going to do more genocide, but okay. Revive the Air Force. The rebel governments of the ways have been able to field planes of their own to contest the skies. It's time to revive the U.S. of A's Air Force and show them who really rules the heavens. Followed up with fuel efficiency. Nah. Oh, we can't do that one. That sucks. Uh, arms development. Uh, wartime draft. Department of Homeland Security. C Communist Legion spies and Brotherhood agents and NCR agents look everywhere. It's only natural to form a department to root them out. Those godless, scum-sucking pieces of garbage. I swear to God, we're going to kill every last one of them. Actually, no, oh, actually, if we take out, it'd be a bad idea right now to take out the Fiends, because that opens up another front against uh, against them. And actually, going to war with the NCR would be really, really beneficial for us, just because we actually will be able to um, grind out a ton of army XP. Are they allied with anybody else? Hopefully, they don't, the White Legs don't want us. Oh, they're fighting the Mormon Alliance, which is fine. And after this one, we read that one. We'll probably go ahead and read the Department of the Navy, because we can. Even before the oil rig fell, the Enclave did not have much in the way of a navy. But now that we have access to the deep rivers and ocean again, perhaps we should revive the Great White Fleet. Wild card. Change in management. Mr. President, now that we've seized New Vegas, we must decide who will help us rule the city. Reports from the courier that we've hired suggest the kings have the support of the people, but although they control Freeside, they have little influence on the Strip. The great families might work with us, although they'll probably chafe under Enclave rule, and we could remind Mr. House... That he used to be a very successful American citizen. Every man has, every man a king has a nice ring. We can work with the old families versus persuade Mr. House to work with the Enclave. I'm gonna do the blue. I mean, that's my favorite color. I kind of want to. I kind of have to go that route. I'm sorry. I just gotta go the way. Also, we we did get the justification done with Murtaugh. I forgot about that. I've already read some of the focuses too. But at this point, I think we already said uh, we're, I'm going to kill them off. But actually, wait, let's do this one first, because we're going to need this. The NCR may believe the rudimentary encryption is enough to secure their communications, but our new radio system makes tracking their codes child's play. Now, we can impersonate even their highest command level structure at least once. Nice. So we'll go to war with these guys, and actually, you know what? I'm, I'm so pissed off at the NCR. Like, we could launch a civil war. Or we could do President Hayes, and this is going to bug it up. I'm, I'm, I'm manually just flying already on these guys. I'm already manually just flying. I'm so sick and tired of the NCR just raiding us. That I will manually kill them off myself, and if things get bugged, and we can't do this focus, I'll just use uh, auto complete them. <clears throat> Mutual exclusive, um, we'll cancel. If the requirements are not met. I will just use console commands. I, at this point, I want to kill off the NCR. These pieces of garbage need to die. 
Enclave Academy would probably be good. I don't like the extra training time, though. But we could use the extra uh, organization, the Navarro Veterans. That actually would be really, really good to have. Really incredibly good to have. Oh. All right, we got that one. That's fine. And we do need the Pentagon Reborn. Loyal Officers would not be bad, but we can kind of wait. Long Range Radio, grip some more decryption. All right, boys, it's time to go in. Y'all good to go? I'm really not worried about this. The power armor is really good, so. Fine with us. Whatever. Oh, did I give you? Oh, my goodness. There you go. Three. Two. One. Ben Scott's got again. God dang it. Well, crap. Go, go, go. And I say, when we go, we go and exterminate with extreme prejudice. And also, you guys go and train. Go and train, 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 train. And just throw on new divisions here. Actually, when you're done, cut you guys down to half. You do that. There you go. Follow it up with a crack of code. Very good, very good. Matthew Bowie. Go inspirational. That's nice. And uranium fever. Well, I don't know, but I've been told uranium ore is worth more than gold. And Broken Hills used to be a booming uranium mining and refining plant. Why don't we make it one again? Why not? Why not? Like the Pokemon. Whoa. Decisions to take. We can take a lot of decisions, man. Pretty nice. Oh, this is Yeah, don't go for that. Thank you. Get rid of the tactics. I'll keep going for more infantry stuff. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, that's not bad. I prefer organization, though, right now. Please keep going, guys. Twin Falls. Straight on up, please. Thank you. Capitulate them, please. If you possibly can. Thank you. That looks pretty nice. They're gonna die. Go, 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 baby. Go. Come on, baby girl. Let's go. Nice, nah, we got him. Thank you, Murta. Actually, that's a case. We, because they took our court, they literally took our court territory. Um, we basically just will always be able to go to where the NCR. So it's not bad that they did take this, because it is our court territory. So we will fight them for this. But once we get it done, we don't have to uh, do anything else with it. So that's actually really nice. Oh, we lost the only thing we had there, huh? All right. Well, whatever. Oh, you got an upgrade. Nice. See, awesome. Let's go with that one. Actually, at this point, we're going to go war with these guys, too. Just because... Oh, they're out of the launch. Oh, that's fine. Just because they will attack us for high trouble territory, so we might as well do that now. The Great Race, a grace to remember. I love the Great Race. All right, after this one, we'll probably just go ahead and do a Department of Homeland Security. That's, that's just... That's very helpful to get, so... A bit, a bit helpful. Show you that one, too. Um, still not according too much stuff here. 40,000 manpower is not bad, though. Close out of that, please. Interact with the followers. You can do that one to get more another city, get more multi population, send out some spies. He's been wounded. Unfortunate. Rapid prototyping is very nice. Let's go ahead and do this one too. Thank you very much. Only 25 army XP, which is awesome. And by going to war, like I said earlier with the NCR, we just can grind out a lot of the stuff for those focuses. Are y'all doing okay over here? Oh, yeah, we definitely want to make these guys a little thicker. And since we get a lot more army XP, there you go. Can we throw on a few of these guys for now? Power armor, power armor. God, I'm, I'm a I'm a huge sucker for power armor. If you know me at all, I love power armor. Is it even worth doing this or throwing this on there? Um, let's see. Get more defense, break through soft attack, hard attack, more reconnaissance as well. You do lose eight organization though, but that soft attack and recon does help out. I do like that. I mean, this would basically hurt us. Let's see, eleven soft attack, almost twenty breakthrough. Honestly, it's not really worth it. So, yeah, I'd love to do this, but... Because you get recon anyways. You do get more organization if you do that, too. I, I almost never do that, but... I, I kind of want to sometimes. What else do we have here? NCR? Is that just an NCR? Of course, the fiends, too, but whatever. These guys aren't too bad right now. Oh, I'm the... I'll let them take those guys out. That's fine. Whatever. Pulse code modifications. Advanced circuitry. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I don't hear guys. Thank you very much, too. They can't beat us. Well, at least hopefully not. There we go. We'll take it all. Ooh, actually. They don't literally deserve any of this stuff, so thank you. And, oh, you're done. Nice. Great. And we'll have to go to War Heaven's Gate, and they'll go to War the NCR, too. Nice. Better radar is nice. Uh, this is some implants. How about that? We're going to lose a little bit of factory output, which is fine. So get what we trickle back. Even though we don't really use that thing right now. But whatever. I'll come over here. And no suicide pills. Darn. No suiciding today. 
Maybe next time. Maybe next time. Thank you very much. Learn as much as you possibly can. Oh, uh, Enclave members only outside volunteers. I kind of want to do that one, but we'll see what happens. Production quotas. What do we have here? Atomic energy. Um, you know what? I think I did this one last time. I think I want to go with this one like this. Because it's not bad, but we don't really need civilian power grids this time. Power stations are really strong. Um, plasma Tesla. Arc jet, too. Ooh, that'd be really nice. But, you know what? I'm going to go Plasma. Let's go try something different. Plasma. Plasma it. Control department of the Navy. Alright, very nice. These guys look intimidating, and they might be a little intimidating, but that's still okay with us. Anything here? Follow demand demilitarization. We're going to blast you with a plasma grenade. If you even ask for anything like that. These guys are not manually justifying us, which just does suck. The defenses are online, though. That's good. But now we can go to war with these guys, too. Because I don't want to waste time. I don't want to waste time with these guys. Let them drain themselves on our line. I mean, they're winning everywhere, so I don't really care. Um, obviously, when we do go to war with the NCR, they're going to blow apart our Air Force, which sucks, but whatever. Look at their map are just dropping like crazy. I love it. It's great. I need to play as Heaven's Gate again someday, but I think I'm going to probably... I'd rather play probably at the time of this recording. New Canaan again faster. Or more more soon. Sooner. More quickly. Than uh, Heaven's Gate. Actually, the Exile I need to play as well. Sorry, just, there's a lot of campaigns that need to be played, but I don't have the time for them. Nice. Very nice. Uh, let's go. This one? No. Let's grab this one. Nice, very good. Uh, they're, they're still going. Department of the Navy is very nice. Arms development. Working together, the military and industry can collaborate to promote a better society for all. We're thinking of calling it the military industrial collaboration or something. Nice. Very nice. Okay, again, it ain't too bad. D Shaky's right there. Chapman. Uh, yeah, I just say I want to get Veronica, so. But I really don't want to get her just yet. It's a little bit too early for me to get her. I want Archie Dornan. Yeah, Archie Dornan would be nice. Stability's pretty nice. Well, the population's okay. 3% is not worth it. For minus 10% war support, that's not worth it at all. First Citizen Lena, I like her a lot. I think she's great to have. We can wait. For now, EPA, we might need that one later on. A corrupt dude. You know what? Get the corrupt dude. I want more PP. I want a lot of PP in this campaign. Like, PP galore. PP, PP, PP galore. 2.24 is really nice. So we still have 1, 2, 3, 4. Some. That's not bad. That's really not bad. Advanced tools. Grab some of that as well. That would be great. We might need to take out the White Legs as well, because they might try to go to war with us. Maybe? Maybe? Not really sure, so we'll see. Uh, here. Grab some of that, too. Cool. Arms development and reclaiming Area 51. Area 51 was a center of elite military research before the war, and some of that surely remains. Too bad it's occupied by trash that we need to clear out. Rats. Oh, we don't like rats. Unfortunate plague on humanity. Three, two, just go. I want you to do what... Just do things that I, I don't want to say. Just... No survivors. They lost 12,000. 13,000. We've lost less than 200 so far. Their air zones are very nice. Let's get some more ground and night, ground night attack. Oh, the NCR! I see what you're doing here. Being some persnickety evildoers. We got ways of making you talk. Very good. More. Oh, come on. More sand. We don't want more sand. Sponsor Railway. Eh, that's a little okay. Support Old World Party. Fall of Heaven's Gate is nice. I'm glad we did that. And investigate more rumors. Santa Ana lost his capital. That's awesome, awesome, awesome. And do that too, because he can. Wow, look at that. They're almost literally completely dead. No, they're, they're literally completely dead now. Very nice, guys. Very nice. I hope we can help hold out down here. That's going to be very hellacious. But that's alright with us. That'd be very okay. Clearing Air 51, Nevada's second city. Although New Reno is Nevada's capital, Vegas is the largest city in Nevada and was lightly damaged in the war. House dreamed of returning to Vegas to its pre-war glory as a jewel of innovation in the bright neon paradise it once was. Since we're an actual organization and not a load man man in a casino, we're going to actually make that happen. Not a bad idea. 48,000 manpower ain't too bad. You know what? At the end, you know what? We can make states along the way. I might just make them states at the very end. Everything's going to be coming to Nevada. At the very end, though, then we'll release everybody. That might be an another path we might want to take, maybe. We'll see. We'll see. How many divisions they got left? Eight. Not bad. Not bad. How are the plane situation doing? Two? Nice. 
Nice. Don't even care what's really happening up there anymore. There you go, nice. Right control gear. It's a way too ahead of time. That's okay to do that one for that one. Um, what else do we get here that we can do? Oh, alright, there you go. That's good. That's some good stuff. How we doing? How we doing? This one's. Oh, we got encircled down here. That's not good. Oh, they're dead anyways. Whatever. How are the Mormons doing right now? Um, they. These guys really might come to war with us first. How fast can we go to war with these guys? They're, oh, that's 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 special. Uh, yeah. We're gonna kill these guys off first. We got tribute or burrows can go suck a fat one. There you go. There you go. Convert you five to these. Oh, we can't even convert that. Oh my gosh. Uh, forging a second platinum chip. Vault 21. Let's do the Groom Lake Testing Center. So let's acknowledge we found at Area 51 or beyond even this enclave scientist and surpass what we thought pre-war engineers were capable of. We can press them into our service, although you have to wonder where they got these ideas. There you go. You can do that if you really want to. I don't really care. Because you're going to push really hard into them. We really can't make these guys any bigger, huh? How about three divisions? No, not even three. Two? Not even a single division. Oh my gosh, that is so bad. That's why we're trying to make more infantry so we can have a bigger cap. Must have just made more divisions too. Holy crud. Sucks. Alright, next focus. After this one. Um, what do we need this one? Develop Prem. We know we need that one. Okay, so Vault 21. The Vault below New Vegas is a source of great pride for the people of New Vegas, yet it could also be a source of great wealth. The secrets and resources in its lower levels are vast and important, so let's plumb the depths and find House's secrets. The Bishop Incident. Well, we already killed both these guys off, so yeah. I want you to force the attack, and need you to force it as well, because we don't have enough divisions on the line just yet. Um... This one. I'm really expecting you guys to do the brunt of the attacks. These some of these guys are literal veterans, which is really nice. Diplomatic training is nice. After these guys, we're gonna go to war with the Mormons as well, because they'll probably be demanding territory too. Hopefully, Oro Burls. Uh, we will have to call Oro Burls too eventually too. Hmm. Come on, baby, get Frisco City. That's nice. That's nice. Is Junction the capital? That sucks. No, oh my god, we got Jean 85 fighters. That's so good. Uh, convene the Nevada legislature. For the first time since the Great War, Nevada's legislature will convene to, to debate the issue of the day. Oh, very nice. Oh, yes, please. Neural interfaces, yes, please. Let's go, baby boys. All the way. All the way. And for the love of God, do not get encircled. Do not die like that. Well, they lost 9,000. That sucks for you guys. 46 versus 22. Jesus Christ. 7,000 we killed? Not bad. Hey, and it's nice. Good job, guys. Keep going in. You're going straight for junction. How close are they to dying? They should be very close. I love power armor. I love it so much. Uh, there you go. Actually, how high are they? I know we still use spies for these guys. Oh, we're at 88 percent. I mean, we could literally coup them, but I hate them so much right now that I just want to kill them. I just want to kill them off, and we are going to kill them off. I swear to God. The 20, Vault 21 was a pre-war experiment set up by vault Tech to observe how a society based around gambling w world would function in isolation. Surprisingly, unlike numerous horror stories found in the wasteland, this vault got by without complications. Due, its, due to its good condition, someone suggested converting it into a nucleus for high-tech industry in Vegas, or turning it into a casino, but seriously, there are a dozen of those. Why do we need one more? Better on industrial growth, not on blackjack. Liberty ships. Before the Great War, the U.S. Navy sailed the world's seas and brought the fight to China's shores directly, although it would be a long time before we can do that again. We can take the first steps and get our uh, men and money back. Ooh, my bad about this. Ooh. Uh, no, get their men their sea legs, as it were. That would be good. My bad. My bad, guys. But seriously, like, I know. The last time I, I remember, the last time I did this, I'm pretty sure I did not kill them off as well as I probably could have. These guys are... Oh, my God, they look so bad. But uh, I didn't do... I did the Civil War path. And I'd love to do the other path, but I, I hate the NCR. I'm going to burn the NCR into the ground. Like, I, I... We have to. We absolutely have to. After how many times did they raid us and steal our territory? Rightful Nevadan territory. It's only fair that we just destroyed them outright. Ooh, and if Legion wants to take... That's really bad for us, too. Hmm. I hope Earl Burles wins, actually. That'd be really good for us. 
I'll just go in if we can. I mean, that's it's not even fair. They have 26 divisions. Oh, we're doing that one too. I probably got. I thought we were doing one. Yep. Um, we still want to do that one too. Send out spies. That's fine. Support us. You know, that's fine. Get more uh, stability later on. Nope. Never done too. How much is it going down? One point one one point two. It's pretty bad. Nice. Forging a platinum chip. Uh, we do that one, but we'll do this one first. Nice. 92% legitimacy is pretty darn awesome, not gonna lie. Machine assisted decryption, commando training, basic drill. I should come down here, do some of this stuff too. Thank you. After this, after Liberty Ships, what else can we do? Institute Emergency Draft. Uh, follow New Game. Nice. Forging a Platinum Chip. What's this? A secret vault of forbidden pre war lore? This is basically why the engineering. Uh, God dang it. This happened again. My apologies once again. Why the engineering core exists, it will get to in no time. Basically, why it exists. So, is this a bad idea? Oh yeah, it is. This is a really bad idea, but we deserve, we deserve to do this. I don't care. I really don't care. These guys have to die. They have to die. And I will kill every last NCR soldier. They will be part of us no matter what. 153,000. 153, That's 153,000 too much. They will die. And I hope they're ready to die. I don't care how many men we have to kill. I really don't. Alright. Uh, we can do more war support, some more stability. Uh, command training is pretty nice. Grab that too. Alright. Uh, military high command. Attrition speed is just over there. More sand. God dang it. Why is it always more sand? Uh, air superiority. Economic resurgence. You know what? I almost never use this one. Let's do air superiority. Why not? Liberty ships. Nice. Can't do anything else over here. Forging a platinum chip. Chip, 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 chip. Major businesses. I should come over here. Bird to bird. Um, more agility for these guys is not bad. But more reliability. I like the reliability. Let's get that one. Naval ship. That stuff. Tim's tanks. Quality. Quantity. Yeah, more armor. After that... Uh, we're starting Rob Co. Robert House founded Rob Co. before the war. And many of its secrets were lost scattered throughout Vegas. Now that we're in control, we can restart the company. Sounds like a good idea. Go ahead and go ahead. Well, time to save. If this goes poorly, which I don't think it really will, but... We always have a backup. Swear to God, you pieces of garbage need to die. You need to die. Call on the sheep. I'm, up here is not too bad. I'm surprised they're not attacking down here, though. I'm actually quite surprised that they're not. Can you guys actually win here? Maybe not. I mean, in general, we can take these. Wait, that's technically our territory, too. What if you guys win on the offensive? Could you actually win here, maybe? I mean, they're attacking here, like, quite, like, quite crazily. But I really don't want to push in too hard, so you guys hold. We actually overran a few divisions. That's actually really nice. Let them attack us, because I we do see them attacking here too, a little bit. Give them a little more time to get a little more organization, and then they should be able to attack us a little bit. Hello. Well, they've abandoned the line. I guess we're going out now. I'm going to get some drinks. By drinks, we've been killing our enemies. Um... Now they're really they're really stacking some divisions up here. Okay. Ah, there we go. That's what we like to see. Killed every last one of them off. Every single last one of them has to die. Has to, has to, has to, has to die. Good, good, good. They, they've literally been in the capital. What is going on here? Oh, the silos. The signals were tracked to missile silos that survived the Great War with bombs ready to go off. Our engineers safely deactivated the nukes, but we needed to decide what to do with them. Some scientists have suggested mothballing the nukes and using plutonium for peaceful means, but nuclear missiles could give us a power tool to finishishing off the United States. However, we'll have to find the launch codes for the nukes, which records on the base suggest were stored at a military base in Northern California. Wait, how do we lose neutral nuclear launch codes? Launch codes. Some scientists suggest we could have set off the nukes by accident if we aren't careful, but only an idiot could do that. We will not trade glory for savagery. Dismantle the nuclear weapons, for you cannot reach out to fellow Americans with nuclear arms. Um. 
I don't know, man. That's a great deterrent against it. If the Chinese try to attack us again, we'll be ready for them. Seriously, where the heck are your divisions? Like, I'm expecting, I'm, I'm expecting extreme bloodshed, but we don't, we can't get that if they're not there. Uh, gearing up for it? Yes, please. By learning from Vault City, day glow and other bastions of civilization, we've learned how to simplify our military production equipment. Seriously, where are your divisions? We've taken flipping shady sands. What the heck? Extract spies. I requisition resources. We lose legitimacy. Nah. Um. Nah. Support the old world party. Nah. Extract spies. Nah. Oh, let's do Fort Huachuca. Huachuca. Yes, please. That was good too. Seriously, I mean, if, they, if they're all up here, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm okay with that. Like, I'm totally okay with that. But still. But still. Seriously. I mean, uh, okay. I'm okay with this, but still. Uh, any more implants? No, we, can't. we gotta wait first. Anything here? No, we can do this. We can just like double time this. Joshua Graham enlists. Although New Canaan has fallen, some of their leaders have survived and made their way to America. Along Among the most noteworthy is Joshua Graham, one of the Legion's founders. Graham seeks vengeance against the Legion for his treatment of the Mormons, and will carry the fire of Holy Spirit against our enemies until he stands before his Lord for judgment. Killing our enemies is like a chore, just like any other. Nice. Shady Sand Remnants. After the fall of Navarro, many survivors tried their luck at integrating into the NCR. While a large number were found out and arrested, many more successfully began their new lives in Shady Sands, these people. And their descendants now petition us to rejoin the Enclave. That's fine with us. Yeah, that's fine. Come on back, guys. Seriously. Where are they? This is uncomfortably too easy. Like, I, I wanted to grind out army XP. Like, with the infantry... Obviously with the power armor here, but where? why? Why is it this easy? So far, I mean, so far, I mean, we found a few divisions here and there, but... I, I don't know what to say. I, I, I mean, just... It's a little bit too easy. Ooh, I would like to get some more support for these guys, but let's go ahead and do... What? Dolchinsky? Uh, we could probably do that one. Yeah, why not? All right. Ooh. Well, realistically, I'm still not able to spend that much army XP. This is really disappointing. I mean, we got some guys down here too. Oh, do you have too many guys? There you go. Are they abandoning the line now? Well, I guess it's time to move out then. Let's go, boys. Let's go. I mean, the thing I hate the most in this entire mod raids. It's not even the dev's fault, but restart Robco. Might as well. Nice. Killed off only 13,000 of them. They still have 132 divisions somewhere, but they're hiding their boys. I don't like it when they hide their boys and we don't know where they're going to be. And the power, don't get me wrong, the power armor's doing great. Like, I love the power, but still. Measure C to Mexicano. Oh, okay, now we got a little bit more conflict down here, too. Alright, alright. Now they're definitely pushing down here. Alright, up here we'll be doing fine. I'm not worried about this at all up here, but... I'm a little more worried with our infantry, because using infantry is really just not a good idea. So, don't follow my advice. Don't use infantry for this. Not a good idea. Not a good idea. Good. Good, now they're going back up north, which is fine. You guys should probably do fine around here-ish. Oh my god. Stop it with these god-awful raids, please. Oh, nice, because some guys over there, that's nice. I hate, I hate raids. I hate raids. It's such a burning passion in this mod. They hurt you when you need your soldiers the most. And that's a fact. Why now? Of all times, why now? This is nice over here. We've got way more air XP than naval XP, or army XP, which sucks. <clears throat> Though, it's time to conscript the peoples of America to protect the nation's interests, the nation and its interests. I right, hurry up this area so we can get this area done so we can get over here. 
Countryside rated it, whatever. I'm not even gonna read that. That's that's such crap. That is just absolute crap. I hate the raids such so much. As you if you know me at all, you know I hate them so much. Uh you guys go in there, that's fine. Thank you, Colonel. Thank you very much. Let him just die on our line. Do we not have enough guns or something? Oh, we need more infantry armor. Okay, that makes sense. That makes quite a bit of sense. And near owner face is pretty nice too. All right, more HP. Yeah, why not? A little bit less factory output. We can suffer the consequences of that for now. Guys, don't waste my time. Go in. And guys, go in. Drag ground support is good too. Hey, hello. Thank you. Um, there you go too. Awesome. Whoa! 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 Why? Why did they go to war with us? Why did they go to war with us? Holy crap! That's I don't know. This happens all the time. Why don't the devs let you know that someone's trying to go into attack you? That literally makes no sense. If we send only eight divisions, we should be fine. But I don't know why that's still an issue in the, this mod. Why is it still an issue? That really should not be an issue. I need the, I need the infantry to attack. Sex city remnants. Uh, welcome back. That's fine. That's fine. No. Just no. Why is that still an issue in this mod? That makes literally no sense why. Well, at least the Legion's in now. That's good. And they will die, so which means we'll probably delete the Legion immediately after this as well. Ah, oh, the Division's kind of on there already, which is actually pretty good. How much remember do they have? Probably quite a bit. 120 maybe? 120,000? Nope, 80,000. Not bad. Not giving up anytime soon, but still. Come on, push, 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 push. Yeah, I, I tried to find a mod where we could use more um, like, I have a Special Forces cap unlimited, but I couldn't find it, so. Specials training, um, power armor integration, I, we just gotta go that way. Rank and file infantry. <sighs> I like to go down this way, but power armor, I just love power armor so much. And we need some more Special Forces cap, so. Um, yeah, we need the cap. Specialist training. If you want to read about this one, please go ahead, as well as this one, but specialist training. As the areas of the military industrial complex, we can train men far above the rival of the Legion or the NCR. We need, we just need more cap. That's all we need. You guys are going to get encircled. You get down to your heads. I need you to go down here and go all the way here. No, 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 no. You go straight through here. You guys got to go, 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 go. And you need to force the attack. You got it. Oh my god. I don't like the special forces cap. It just does not. It literally makes no sense. It literally makes no sense to be in a mod like this. I mean, I get that, that you know, you need balance, but still. I don't see I don't see the, the point of having a special forces cap to a degree. Yes. It needs to be in the game, maybe. But then again, I mean, as a defensive me mechanism, like, if there's. If an enemy has too much special forces, like too much power armor, just use a lot of anti tank. I mean, <laughs> just use a lot of anti-tank. Or dynamite. Anything like that. Um, let me just go, go through here. Burn the NCR to the ground. How are they not dead yet? These are some of the worst power divisions I've seen. Can you go? Oh my god. Move your butt. Why does it take that long to kill these guys off? And earlier. I mean, why? why? Why do we not get warned about enemies come, like justifying on us? That's a huge failure, I would say, of the mod currently. Like, I don't know. I could be completely wrong. But it, it, it's been in the mod long enough that it, it should have been fixed by now. But it might be a Hoi 4 thing. It might be, maybe. But I've not encountered that in any other mod so far. I'm sorry that I'm turning this into a little bit of a rant. But I think I deserve to rant about this a little bit. I mean, I've been playing Overworld Blues for quite a while, so I don't just don't understand why this is still in the mod. Then again, the devs don't like me too much, probably, so. <laughs> Alright, thank you very much. 
fine. Keep going, keep going. Well, you know what? The infantry were struggling down here, but now we're doing okay. After this, we probably gotta fight Legion too. Which sucks, but it's not that bad. A lot of power armor will do okay. Power armor integration. Although we always relied on power armor, one of our officers wants to take this to the next step. Captain Wilson Freeman has published a treatise calling for a lightning war where power armored flanks enemy positions, cuts off their lines of retreat, and captures the survivors. This might just work. Oh my god, please, stop getting encircled. Please, 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 please. Good. Kill them off. Infrastructure prioritization. Nice non-ontological bombing. Alright, well they died, actually. They died a lot faster than I thought they would, actually. That's alright. They, they, they deserve to die. We need to purge. And purge we will. Launch codes detected. Now that we liberated Navarro from America's enemies, the Army Corps of Engineers is going through old records and has come across something interesting. They've managed to find launch codes for missile silos, although most of these codes were lost during the war or after due to vault tech subversion. If you ever find missiles that weren't used, it could come in handy. Wait, they'll probably work in Ashton. Chinese Menace. San Fran was one of the greatest cities of pre-war America, center tech and a window to the world. But now it's occupied by the Shia Chinese beachhead on the American soil. Some say we must drive them into the ocean, others mindful of Camp Turtle Dove and other pre-war mistakes. Suggest we give the city autonomy and welcome the Shia into the reunited states. A Chinatown on the west coast? I think not. Not bad. Did you get encircled here, you pieces of garbage? Can you just win? Nice, another forbidden pre war base. Yeah, I mean, we don't get told when someone is justifying against us. I'd say that's failure, man. Absolute failure. Oh, there you go. Cool. Now you guys can come on back. And actually, now it's just against a she. Even though now we got to plan out for the whole Legion. God dang it. That sucks. Ooh, and the Troll Warren are not doing very well, so, which is fine. Hmm. Gonna be a lot of holes here. I'll probably send some guys right there. I'll send some more guys over here. Cover the entire lineup over here, which is fine. Head to Del Solisto down there. Uh, guys, go. Guys, come on. Come on. you got to move faster than this. You've got to move faster. Oh, my God. Why'd you guys stop? we got San Francisco. we got to get Concord. Machine encrypted learning. I do apologize, though, for being ranty. I don't know. These past few days of the time this recording have been pretty tough, so... My apologies. My apologies. Um, good. President Hayes... We'll do that later. Uh, Bishop incident? The Lu Lucia incident. We have enough T-51 power armored around that we can fake a Brotherhood attack on NCR outposts. At the same time, we'll order an attack on the Brotherhood using cracked NCR high command codes. This should be enough to tip off their fragile piece. Or to tip it, really. Digital encryption? Encryption? Oh, look, and there they go. This is the much more deserving fate of the NCR. After all the crap they put us through, They can go suck a fat one. The world will be Nevada by the time we're done here. Well, there's a lot of factors by the time we're done here, too. We need a lot more of uh, this stuff, too. Alright, so be it. We're gonna be way, 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 way out of infantry armor. That's fine, with though. Alright, because we'll have to go to war with these guys next immediately. Actually, does this cancel either one? No, President Hayes. Thanks for support. President Hayes and the Old World Party have swept, been swept into office. Nice. Uh, Legion Mar- Oh, there goes Legion Marches, yeah. With the fall of New California, the greatest point of Legion lies in ashes. So who's going to stop Kaiser and is better to conquer the wastes? That one too. And excavate the lab. We'll see what happens. Hopefully it's good. If it's not, well, then we're kind of screwed. And that's okay. Alright, so that's going to be a little more difficult. We're going to you guys right there. And you all do this. You all do that. Take you all happy, y'all. Go right there. Do that. Go halfies to... I'm going to leave one there. I'm going to do the same thing kind of here-ish, too. Half-half. Yeah. Actually, that's not too bad. Five and half. Oh, that's actually pretty good. That's actually pretty good, yeah. Uh, we've got the power armor down here, too. I'm going to send you guys to where? There you go. Send half you guys away, because that's a pretty small spot. You'll be fine. You guys will be fine probably right there, too. 
10 division should be good enough. And we got quite a few guys here to do this. So right there. That's a single place. Five divisions, will, six divisions will not be enough right there, which is fine, whatever. And which he actually leaves you guys too, so. You actually might just come here and just push out. Actually, that probably would be a really good thing, so boom, boom, boom. All spots are covered, except for this spot right here, which is fine. There you go. And I don't want to forget this too, because I remember that infrastructure is really bad around here, so. Might as well build up the roads, yeah. Actually, you know what? That's make a little different in this campaign. We're going to take everything first, and then release every state individually right at the end. We'll try that. Is it going to work? Probably not, but. The Boneyard Remnants, welcome back. Nope. You get nothing. Nothing from us. Cool. Um, no, nothing there. We're still on war economy. Oh, hence the soul skilling itself. Nice, good job, guys. Uh, armaments, unpopular pragmatist. Yeah, that's a grabber. Oklahoma, very cool, very very cool, Oklahoma. Um. I grab you, do that too. Awesome, awesome. We got a more PP. Joshua Graham. Welcome, Joshua Graham. Glad they use your expertise. Anywhere else we haven't really hit? Not really. Got pretty much everything covered. Here's fine, here's fine, up there is fine as well. Just in case, I guess you can come over here maybe. We might need to move him around, but I think Joshua Graham is going to do pretty darn well for us. Night person. There you go, not bad. Advanced servos. Cool. Do apologize once again for my rage earlier, but just I think it's justified. Some things in the, in the Hoi Fort just aggravate me. Actually, let's go into this too. The Menace from Washington. The Washington Brotherhood. Fresh from its conquest of the Troll War and, and, and others lost for more. More resources. More slaves, technology, and with the NCR, New California still bitterly divided as extending its claws towards the United States. Well, that ain't good. I do want to do this stuff, but realistically, I don't want to do it yet. Yeah, I'm going to save this stuff for last. Developing Prim, we need Prim, Nipton. Uh, what else can we do here? I don't want to do that stuff yet. Alright, so at this point, um, overall, I think I'm just going to go with the reject ghouls. I want to do something a little bit different than this time. So if you want to read about this one, please go right ahead. Because I did this one last time and accept Super Mutants. I've never done, I've never accepted ghouls and rejected Super Mutants. So if you want to read that, please go right ahead. But actually, I'll probably do that too anyways. Reject ghouls. How can we claim ghouls are American citizens? They are mutated far beyond even being human. Most of them are feral, bloodthirsty creatures, and few that aren't can turn at any time. Let us leave these relics in the past. There's no room for them in our newly reborn America. Just because... I want to try something different. It's got to be a little bit different, right? Are our divisions over here yet? What are you doing? Why are you taking so long? Why, why, why do you suck? Stop sucking. Go faster. <laughs> we'll do that one, because we can. War propaganda? Eh, kind of okay. Non-dialogical bombing is fine. Cool. Nice. Battle caps. Ooh, actually, for this one, let's do a nuisance and skip. We got plenty enough money, so. Uh, that one, too. Cool. This will definitely help us out, because we do need a ton more of this stuff. Actually, that's something a lot better. 30 a day is pretty good, actually. Uh, we almost have some of these lines covered yet, which is good. My god, guys. Move faster. Move faster. We're not going to be ready for war if you just take your sweet booty time. Why are you going so slowly? Three... <laughs> it's not the infrastructure's fault. They're blaming it on the infrastructure. Come on, go, 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 go. Jesus Christ. So dumb. Bad rejecting ghouls. Oh, that's nice. And this one... I'll do this one too. Legends tell us of a time when the super mutants were more numerous and organized, led by a figure known as the Master. They attempted to replace humanity as the dominant species of this planet. Luckily for us, they failed. Now we'll have to make sure they never have a chance to try again in a common enemy. The peoples of the wasteland can be united under the enclave if we stoke anti ghoul and mutant prejudice. Uh, but uh, Canadian pirates join the Brotherhood. To the north of Washington lies Broken Coast, where pirates bludgeon their prey, prey to death with Canada's sacred clubs, the fearsome hockey sticks. 
We'd hope they'd uh, <clears throat> serve as a nuisance to the Brotherhood and tie down their flanks, but now they formed a blood pact with the Brotherhood to seize California, which can offer far more loot and slaves than the Northwest. Should war with the Washington Brotherhood break out, they may try to harass our coast and supply lines. Of course, the United States Navy wet its teeth fighting pirates 500 years ago. Perhaps it's time to pick up some old habits. Cool. Oh, uh, someone says, like, earlier, this is another comment, um, like, when we started out, someone says that they're not sure if rapid expansion was worth it. Um, just because, you know, it, it, it was a lot of cost to hide from the NCR. I would say it was worth it overall because you need more factories. You need a ton of equipment so you can just rush out divisions so you can, like, stop hiding from the uh, from the NCR. So I would say overall it was pretty much worth it. I mean, that's not the, an optimal way, maybe, but I, th I think it was worth it, so. Uh, let's see. I think that's pretty much it. There we go. We hit most of stuff of the comments, which is good. Very, very good. How much longer do we have to wait before we go to war? Um, yeah. We got 30 days left. 30 days. Let's at least read one more focus after this. So we, I did that one. I've, I don't think I've ever gone, out of that, gone down that path before. Yeah, I'm going to do a different way wait, wait to do this stuff. Uh, yeah, I can probably go to Battleborn. That's not too bad, actually. Not great, but it's okay. Establish a justice system. Nevada's people do believe in justice, but it's a bit of a rough and ready system, relying on former Desert Rangers, personnel from Vault City, and perhaps even some followers. We can take steps to form a real justice system, but tomorrow's episode will begin going to war with the good old Legion. Oh, look at that. They go to war with Painted Rock? Well, that's nice. But, hey, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below. Let me know what your thoughts are for this campaign so far, and I will see you tomorrow, when we will go to war with the Legion, and probably the Washington Brotherhood. Thanks for watching. Have a great... Rest of your day.